Hello guys, welcome to the next video on Node.js tutorial for beginners. In this video, we will see how we can download and install Node.js on our Windows operating system. So let's get started. First of all, open your favorite browser and uh, search for Node.js uh, download. And the first link which will appear here will be Node.js.org, which is the official link. So you can just uh, click this link here okay and in here you will be able to see different kind of uh, installations but on the node.js home page so when you click this icon here you will see uh, the two versions for windows one is the lts version which is long uh, term service version right and one is the current version so we are interested in current version so i'm going to install this one but if you want to install this long term version which will be available for a long time then you can uh, just install this one so i'm going to click this option and uh, the file will be downloaded which is about 12 megabytes so i'm going to save it and let's save it somewhere okay so once this file is saved we are going to just uh, install it so just click your uh, msi file so the extension of this uh, file will be dot msi so just click this and then start installing the node.js right now node.js installation on windows is really easy and uh, you know you cannot get an easy installation than this installation so first of all this kind of uh, wizard will start you just need to click next here and accept terms uh, license and conditions and then click next this is the location where node.js will be installed so if you don't have any good reason to change it just leave it as default and then click next now in here these are uh, the things the, that will be installed in uh, with the node.js so the node.js runtime npm package manager which is uh, really important for developing node.js applications online documentations and uh, the path so this node.js path will be installed or configured on your windows operating system so you can uh, you know start node.js using your command line okay so just click next here and once you click next you just need to click this install button to start the installation now the installation may take few seconds uh, to few minutes depending upon the configuration of your uh, windows operating system so just wait for uh, this process to complete and once uh, the installation will complete we will uh, go to the next step okay so now the installation of node.js is uh, successfully completed on my windows operating system and I just need to click this finish button. Now to know whether Node.js is successfully installed on your system or not, you need to open your command prompt. So just search for uh, command prompt and open your command prompt. And in here, you just need to type node minus V, which is uh, going to give you the version of Node.js installed, right? So just press enter and it will give you the version of node.js which you have installed so it's giving v 6.5.0 this is the same version you can see here when we have downloaded it from the node.js website v 6.5.0 right so we know that node.js is successfully installed on our system now we have also installed npm which is node package manager which with this uh, node.js installer and uh, node package manage manager is really important in developing uh, you know node applications and i will um, you know illustrate what npm is and how it works in uh, details in the later videos but in this video we will just check whether it's successfully installed or not so just write npm for node package manager minus v for knowing the version of it right so npm minus v and hopefully it will also give you the version of uh, npm installed okay 
so now we know that node uh, is installed successfully on our system and npm is also installed on our system so now we can start building our uh, you know for example hello world uh, application so just to check you just need to write node in order to start working with node so just write node and press enter which will give you this kind of uh, command line interface and in here you can just write uh, for example console dot uh, log and in the brackets so in the brackets you just need to write for example hello node so just write uh, hello node okay and now you can press enter and it's going to print out hello node and then this undefined uh, message and then you know that node is perfectly working on our, your system now let's check this node uh, in a little bit better way so what we want to do now is i'm going to just close this uh, command prompt and i will once again go to the node.js website and now this time i'm going to go here which says about tab so just click about tab here and in here you will see the basic bare bone uh, code to uh, you know get started with node which is this code okay so what i'm going to do here is i'm going to go to a folder just go and create any folder in which you want to you know create your node.js project for example and then here i'm going to create a javascript file so i'm going to let's uh, create a javascript file and i'm going to name it as app.js for example so just write app.js and press enter we are going to uh, you know see how uh, we can uh, build our node.js uh, application using some editor better than uh, for example normal editor on windows or uh, linux so this we will see in the later videos but for now let's use uh, for example i have notepad plus plus for uh, javascript so i will open this uh, app dot js file in uh, notepad plus plus but you can use any editor of your choice for now right and then i'm going to once again go to this page and i will just copy all the code from here just copy all the code and then i'm going to paste it here okay and then just save this code okay so just copy and paste this code and save this code and then i'm going to minimize everything once again so my code is saved and now i want to uh, open the command prompt in this folder and the easiest way to do is uh, you can do cd to uh, you know this uh, path and uh, it will be okay but the easiest way is to just press your shift button so just press shift button and then right click on this folder and then you will see uh, this option which says open command window here so just uh, click this option and you can see we are directly in this directory uh, in the command line so we are in the samples directory which is uh, here itself right now in here what we can do is we just need to give this command so just give node command and then the file name so file name is app.js in our case so this file we have created right now right so just write app.js js here and press enter okay now if you uh, will notice here it's giving this uh, message that uh, we can uh, open 127.0.0.1 which is the local host on our pc uh, colon this port so on port 3000 of the local host we can see this uh, server running so I'm going to open my browser once again and in here I will just give the same address which was printed here so 127.0.0.1 and then port 3000 right which is the same address which is printed here this address okay and then press enter and you can see 
hello world is printed here so you know that your node.js server is working perfectly fine on your windows operating system and you know that you have uh, you know installed node.js perfectly on your windows operating system so in this way you can download and install node.js on your windows operating system i hope you've enjoyed this video please wait comment subscribe and bye for now